Ivan Garcia here in Santa Clara for a showdown that went down to the wires. Wilcox hosts Menlo Atherton. Midway through the first, Chargers driving down the field as Andrew Palacios gets the handoff, uses some second effort to get the first down. Wilcox now in the red zone, Chargers pull a Houdini and Frankie Tagoai ends up with the ball and and with the 18 yard score, PET good, 7-0 Wilcox. Bears looking to answer in a big way. The deep, high arcing pass is juggled in the air and Daniel Escorza grabs the interception for the Chargers as the first ends Wilcox up seven. Great awareness by Escorza. Menlo Atherton get on the board in the second. Sherrod Smith gets the rock, makes a move and scores from seven yards out. PAT good, game tied at seven. Time winding down in the second. Palacios loses the ball, regains control, and he will not give up on the play as he muscles his way in for a nine yard touchdown. PT good, Chargers lead 14 7 at the half. First play of the third quarter was a big one. Smith gets a handoff at the 20, shakes off a tackle, runs down the sideline, turns on the Jets. He would get stopped by Jeremiah Willis after a 57 yard gain. Then a few plays later, Billy Johnson finds his 6-7 tight end in the red zone. PT is good, and the game is tight again going into the third. Early fourth, charges at the goal line. Elijah Diallo Walker forces his way in for six, and he was pumped. After the PAT, Wilcox is back in front, 21-14. Less than four minutes left in the game. Billy Johnson in the pocket, looks down the field, and connects with his five-star wideout, Jerion Dickey, for the 30-yard touchdown. The Bears decide to go for two, but the Chargers defense would come up with a big stop to deny the two-point conversion to keep the 21-20 lead. Bears have one more chance to get the ball back. Walker gets the ball on third down and gets way more than the first 38-yard run to ice the game. Walker had himself a huge night, 188 rushing yards. Here's what he had to say about Wilcox moving on to 4-0. It feels great. It gives us a lot of momentum going into the rest of the season. We're looking for Gatos. Uh, next week we got Mountain View, so that's going to be a really good game too. We just got to keep on doing what we did against Menlo and just keep working.